Tonight, a local racetrack is getting ready to change hands. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rebecca Chung. Heartland Motorsports Park is now sold, but who is the mysterious buyer that shut down the auction early today? Working for you, 27 News reporter Drew Gill has been trying to find out, and he's live outside the track tonight. Drew, what can you tell us? Well, Rebecca, questions are swirling about this mystery buyer, and I have been working all day to track down some answers. Now, some are asking, is it the city of Topeka? I can confirm tonight that is not the case. A city spokesman told me they did not buy the property, but what we know right now is that a private bidder made an offer for an undisclosed amount. The highest public bid for was for $3.5 million. And according to Shawnee County, this mystery buyer is going to owe a lot of money in back taxes currently owed by Chris Payne, the former owner. It's more than $3 million to be exact. That's on top of the money they spent on the park. Right now, I'm told more than $1,300 in interest is piling onto those back taxes each day. The county says no one will get the deed to the property until that money is paid back. Taxes follow the property. So until that those taxes are paid, it'll, they'll continue to collect interest and any new owner will be responsible in full for those taxes. Payne closed the auction around 4 p.m. today, about two hours early after getting an offer. It's unclear whether Payne or the new buyer will foot the bill for those back taxes. But Payne previously told 27 News his plan was to use the auction to pay those debts. I also talked to one of the auctioneers who says they may have some more details to share in the days to come. And of course, we will keep you updated on the future of Heartland Park as we learn more. Working for you live from Shawnee County, Drew Gill, 27 News. All right, Drew, thank you for that live report.